Hello, welcome back to Divine Honesty. This is your host, Sierra, And today we're going to be focusing on Taurus energy, okay? <clears throat> Not all aspects about a card is going to resonate with each Taurus. What you can do, if you find that it's not resonating, you can put me on mute and look at the meanings in the cards yourself and look at the story. Sometimes you can resonate um, with it yourself by interpreting the pictures yourself, okay? Also, you can go to my Divine Honesty Facebook group. Join there for like-minded individuals, or you can look at other videos I have on my YouTube channel um, that resonate with you better, Taurus. I also have Taurus X videos if you want to get more information and insight on your X. Um, and with that being said, let's get started. Okay, what is the energy surrounding Taurus? What is the energy surrounding Taurus? Okay, what is the energy surrounding Taurus? Wow, so we have the Page of Cups. Ooh, so someone could be getting in a relationship or rekindling a relationship, especially with the holidays. You know, love is being spread more around. You know, the ideology of love and being thankful um, is being pushed for monetary value, but that's a whole nother story. So there is some type of offering. Someone has a crush. Either you have a crush on someone or someone has a crush on you or there's some offering. You also can be pregnant, okay? Or just really in your emotions, really feeling someone, okay? Really feeling love and appreciate it. This is a beautiful card, Taurus, okay? Then we have the nine of the eight of pentacles. So some of y'all working on something, I'm saying. Um, you could be going back to school, working on yourself or trying to prevent um certain habits from occurring or just personal growth this also means personal growth okay okay so personal growth working on yourself some of you could be working on your carriage to speak up about something we're in the relationship or working on your carriage to you know reach out to a crush okay reach, reach out to somebody you have love for then we have the king of pentacles so some of you definitely are dealing with another earth sign Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, you don't have to be, but this deals with stability. Some of you are definitely thinking about and working on your coins, okay, doing overtime or just having somewhere stable, working on getting a place, working on a house, okay, working on a career, going back to school, things of that nature, okay. So this can definitely mean some of you guys are definitely going back to school or picking up a skill or reading or just working on personal growth or trying to find your inner spirituality. Um, and you're, so for some of you, you're definitely falling in love with the idea of getting better, okay, having standards, having goals, okay. With this card, it's representing, you know, the idea that you should laugh more, okay. Get involved with people around you. Do simple things. If you only do very important things, you will become dead serious. Okay? Do fun, light, and love and normal routine-ish things. Okay? Find your life in that. Okay? Find your life in people, happiness. Okay? And with, with that being said, this car... Say thank you to your inner being, okay? Even though you cannot see it at the moment, what you say to it can change the vibration inside and make you light and open and full of love, forgiveness, and joy. Some of you are working on how to forgive something, how to let something go. And the biggest component to that is yourself and your perception of of the forgiveness or letting go surrounding the person place and thing it says talk to yourself okay talk to yourself say thank you for yourself apologize to yourself that you allow someone to come in here and treat you as such okay it's all about opening forgiveness and love you're needing if you're wanting forgiveness from someone or you want someone to forgive you or you want someone to apologize do it to yourself first. Vibrate, vibrate with that energy first, okay? Then you have the King of Pentacles here. Be patient. Everything comes to you in the right moment, okay? Remember, you owe yourself an apology for letting people get comfortable with treating you like it, your average, okay? Remember, despite how open and peaceful 
and loving you attempt to be, people can only meet you as deeply as they meet their self. All right? As deeply as you meet yourself. And with this, I'm saying, you know what? Find your love. Find things you do that is purely from love. Not from money. Not from attention. Not for fame. Work on that craft. And you will become successful, Taurus. You will become successful. It's right here. That energy is telling you how to align with it. How to vibrate with it. Okay? And remember, what you give power to has power over you if you allow it. So remember, ideas and thoughts are crucial in manifesting your reality. Not crucial, they're essential, okay? It's the overall point. Like I said before, be patient. Everything comes to you in the right moment, okay? Be patient. Everything comes to you in the right moment. So let's go ahead and get some clarity on these cards. Tell me why I have the Page of Cups here. We have the Ace of Pentacles, a new start, a new job, a new idea, a new, a new um, career, a new opportunity, a new blessing. Okay, this comes from ideas that you're having at night. So whatever you think about at night, right before you're going to sleep or if you're dreaming or if you're just watching TV, whatever you're doing, find that time between you between the time you're up and when you're about to go to bed about a new opportunity, a new blessing, what you can do in life to allow you to get on this new path. Because this does also resonate with the eight of pentacles. You working on your personal growth or you're working on your business or you're working on yourself. Then we have the eight of pentacles. Ooh, the six of wands. So this is definitely attention. Look at this picture. People are going to notice your endeavors. They are going to notice notice your change in behavior. They're also going to appreciate that. Now, some of them slicks might not say anything or slick be jealous, but that's when you will find out who's in your life for seasons and reasons, okay? And then you have this. Look at how these cards match up perfectly. Working on yourself, working on your money, on your coins will get you recognition, okay? For example, it could be social media recognition. It also can just be <clears throat> recognition from your job, recognition from getting that degree, recognition from getting more money, okay? But you will be recognized for working on yourself, okay? And then you have the King of Pentacles. Why is the King of Pentacles here? Oh, the Two of Wands. Okay. So now the Two of Wands represents paths being taken. There's different paths being taken. One to a mountain and one to a forest. It is up to you. Do you want to take it the hard way but not her not jumping on this energy of self-redefinement? You want to keep trying to have to go through mountains up and over, up and over? Or do you want to go through a straight path? And the straight path consists of consistency, Taurus, which you do have. More than any sign, you do have consistency. So all you got to do is align yourself with this energy and honey. Bam, there it goes. Especially when you give power to the idea that you can become anything you want, okay? Remember, patience and consistency will get you to the end quicker than um, rushing or just wanting something, okay? You know, laugh more, like I said. Get involved with people around you. Also, connect with people that is on your same wavelength. Even if you're not a business owner, but you want to be a business owner, relate to those business owners. You can go to Facebook and get into business owner uh, groups, okay? If you want to do better in, at your job and get farther in your job, try to relate and form friendships around the people that's already supervisor and managers, okay? Re get yourself in the vibratorial space in order to vibrate um, to the level you want to be, okay, Taurus? Now, if this reading resonates, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. This has been another Divine.